Welcome back to my corner of the internet, guys. I am the Lucid Dream, and on this one, we are going to take a look at a fraud auditor who is doing anything he can to make someone pay attention to him. First and foremost, thank you to all of my channel members and subscribers. Without you, I wouldn't be here. So as always, every day, thank you. Let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, guys, what's going on? The date is 6-7-2024. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we got, okay, it looks like four uh, deputies and then we got three sergeants over here, which is pretty pathetic. It's absolutely pathetic. I mean, look at them. They're failing to identify. Now I have to go and file a complaint against these fucking pigs. And then that was a fucking Karen. So now I have to go and file a complaint against all of them because they're failing to identify. Oh, wait. So I've been sitting here trying to figure out who this idiot reminds me of. And it finally hit me that it is Scott Farkas from The Christmas Story. Look at that. The resemblance is striking. Even the attitude. Like, I can totally see Scott Farkas growing up to be an idiot frauditor. 100 percent uh you know the, these officers are under no obligation to identify themselves to him he is not subject of an investigation he is approaching them not vice versa they're under no obligation to identify to him the entitlement of this idiot is monumental even the general public tells him he's an idiot and all he can do is call her a karen because of course, why not? That That is the limit of his imagination and mental capacity. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, this one right here, okay, to the left. So, earlier he told me that, so they were failing to identify. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have to file a complaint on him and not recommend him for promotion. Absolutely, period. I mean, this man is disgusting. I mean, seriously. I mean, these are three sergeants right here. Okay, these five pigs over here failed to identify when I asked them as a member of the public. What happened is, my phone died. I had to delete footage. So, see, what happens is when... So, when you have to stop filming, obviously, they're going to act up. And they're going to do what they want to do because... They can do what they want to do. So, okay, all right. So, that's... What is that? That's Terry versus Ohio. So, basically, you have to show them your front, and you have to show them back. So, they can't Terry stop you. Okay, all right. So, the reason they are here tonight is acting as deterrence. But right now, they are acting as jokes, especially this corporal right here. Oh, that says canine. Oh, that is... Holy crap, this man is pathetic. He is so desperate to get them to pay attention to him that he just keeps repeating himself. He's trying anything he can to get a reaction out of him, and they're just ignoring him. They know he's insignificant. This is why bother? I, I love it. I love the officers are not giving him the time of day, and he is, he is just not happy about it. Oh, that is one of the worst pigs in the police department canines because what canines do is most likely they beat their dogs so this guy is a women beater and a dog beater most likely how embarrassing brother i mean holy crap dude dude i mean if i you better not beat your woman i mean i'm telling you right now dude i mean that'll fire me up that'll get to me that'll absolutely get to me that's disgusting, brother. I mean, dude, you're smiling like a corporal. I mean, dude, look at how... FTO, you're a field training officer, and you're acting like this. How fucking disgusting, bro. I mean, dude, it's pathetic. Oh, I... Oos, I thought you were a good cop, bro. I really did. I thought you were good, man, but obviously you're... You've lost it, mate. You've completely lost it. I mean, it's pathetic. Okay, so they're over here right now. 
contemplating, oh, can we arrest this guy? Oh, can, can we take him to the dungeon? Oh, hey, go right ahead. Hey, my stepdad, he's an attorney. Go right ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. See what happens. See, but these pigs, they know. So we're not going to do anything at all. And these three. Oh, my goodness. So pathetic. I mean... So this one on the left, so what he did, he came over with me. So, and then we were talking to them and then I was asking for them name and their badge numbers. And then he just went along with it because he is who he is. It's a pathetic person. I mean, God. I would really like to know what he thinks he's accomplishing by doing this. If he really thinks that this makes him look good. Because uh, obviously it doesn't. But I really want to know if he thinks it does. Because all it makes him look like is a sad, sad little man who has absolutely nothing better to do. But is this just an a, just a, a, a desire to go viral where he thinks that he's going to start this revolution against the police because he says these police are bad? Everybody is going to believe him without any evidence? Because I, I don't, I don't see that happening. I mean, I'm stunned. I'm, I'm amazed. Um, the bars are closed. I mean, I'm just out here, acting as the tourist, just watching. And so this guy right here, yeah, no, him right there. I'm following a play on him, for sure. Oh, hey, sir, Sergeant Long. He actually just called me today. He was like, oh, that cop from two months ago who didn't identify? I was like, oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. I was like, would you like me to send you the video footage of the other one who failed to identify? He was like, oh, yeah, you can send that to me. But reality is, I know nothing is going to basically happen for you guys not identifying. I mean, it's pathetic. It's absolutely pathetic. And you're just standing over here ignoring me. So he just starts making massively unfounded allegations out of nowhere. Just starts pulling shit out of his ass. Because he has nothing else to say. Not a single thing. His only complaint with these officers is the fact they aren't playing his game. And he's mad about it. So he's going to cry. That's it. Really, really, really beyond pathetic. Uh, this is, I think, is, I think he calls himself Alaska Audits or something. It's a pretty small channel. Um, and I imagine it's going to stay this way because, um, yeah, he sucks. Massively sucks. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you would like to see. And I will catch you on the next one.